la 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 the big black bug bit the big black bear made the big black bear bleed blood big black bear big black bear what is up youtube today we're gonna go out and we're gonna rip some balls with team banjo legs but first let me bore you guys with just a quick little update of the reef tank so Finally got some of my control system mounted the way I wanted it. Got the uh, auto top off. It automatically keeps a monitor of the water level in here. Got the protein skimmer skimming the nastiness out of the water. Let's see here, some livestock update. Where is the cleaner shrimp? Oh, I got some corals there with a nasty looking bristle worm coming out of it. I got to do something about that. Uh, we got some corals added to the tank. A couple of corals. Got a uh, blue zinnia there. There's a little peppermint shrimp. Where's he at? He's right there. Little peppermint shrimp. Coral banding shrimp's down there in the hole. The cleaner shrimp is right there. Um, That pretty much does it for the fish tank. Oh, and I do have a little pump here that uh, to increase the flow in the tank. Probably can't see that too well. It's in there. So anyway, let's get out there and rip some balls. Another quick update. The camper situation. I got in there and I looked at the camper. And I, uh, actually, someone was interested in buying it. And he come over here and we got all inside of it and looked at it. And that daggum thing is... A whole lot worse off than I thought it was. I'm afraid that pulling it down the road, the side panels is just going to open up and it'll look like it's been through a daggum hurricane before it ever gets there. And I might just end up, if I did haul it down there, I'd probably just leave the damn thing down there somewhere accidentally. But anyway, uh, I'm not 100% decided I may not do the trailer project, but I may move my efforts towards the Suburban back there. Because all that thing really needs is just an oil change and check some things and it's ready to go. And then I could probably just put like some kind of window unit in the window and I, I could have a smaller generator and not have to uh, spend so much money trying to just make a little trip to South Carolina to rip balls with all my buddies. So anyway, back to ripping with Team Banjo Legs and three, two, one. HBK, yeah, you know how we Well, warm-up packs aren't going too great. Uh, I don't know what's going on. I, don't, I have no idea. So back to back to ripping balls with Team Banjo legs. Y'all, but I doubt my respect, and that's real, that's real, that's 
what I need y'all to do is pause this video. If you're on a computer, open up another tab, go over to YouTube and search Risky Biscuits. Give him a sub. He's whipping ass. He's getting close to 500. He's doing something special when he gets to 500. If you're on a smartphone, just figure it out. I'll put his link in the description. Check him out. It's worth a shot. Trust me. Well, screw that spot. Now we're going to get to the meat and potatoes of this vlog. It's bando time. Well guys, I had a blast. This place, there it is like a, a small city. You've got this building, that building, another building back there, the big tower back there, the other building. There's buildings everywhere. It's like a small city. Anyway guys, thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe. As a reminder, I want to remind you to go check out Risky Biscuits channel. Be sure to sub to him. He's getting close to 500 subs. He's that guy over there. Currently undecided right here. This guy you need to sub to his channel because he's one of those people that that are progressing like faster than you can even keep up with so there's that and then we got christian over there does he have an fpv name not yet in the comment section let's give christian an fpv name without fpv at the end because that's kind of lame like tech fpv <laughs> so anyway we're yeah, sure and see you in the next one